Hello and welcome to Fast Keys TV. My name is Peter and I'm Head of Technical Support here at Fast Keys and today I'm going to be going through cam locks with you. Cam locks are most commonly used on metal furniture such as filing cabinets and lockers and have many other applications including computer cabinets, post boxes, cash boxes and key cabinets. They are made up of three main components. First is the housing or lock body. Second is the cylinder. Third is the actuator arm, normally referred to as the cam. This is the metal bar that locks the furniture in place. The cam itself can be in many shapes and sizes depending on the furniture it is fitted to. It can be flat, cranked or hooked. There are several variables to consider when choosing a cam lock. Body length, the fixing hole, the turn and movement, the cam, whether you want it master keyed and whether you want it keyed like or keyed to differ. The body length is measured from the back of the lock face to the tip of the lock. Like this. The fixing hole. The fixing hole is commonly measured from thread to thread and flat to flat. The turn. This is normally either 180 degrees or 90 degrees. There are four different types of cams. The straight cam, the cranked cam, the hooked cam, and the cranked hooked cam. The way to measure these is, for a straight cam, you measure from the center of the fixing hole to the tip of the cam. For a hooked cam, you measure from the center of the fixing hole to the inside edge of the hook. And for the cranked cam, you measure from the center of the fixing hole to the tip of the cam. And you also need a second measurement which is the depth of the crank. This is the depth of the crank minus the thickness of the cam. If you found this video helpful, please feel free to leave a comment below and like and subscribe us. Locks are fun.